At this moment, as Myanmar stirs from its deep slumber, we must ask ourselves, what are the ingredients of positive change? The nation has many challenges in order to join the developed world, and often the international spotlight casts harsh and unseemly shadows on our struggles. As we crank up the old machinery and replace it with the new by building infrastructure and a health system that can serve our citizens, the recurring and insurmountable issue in Myanmar is lack of intellectual capital. What is the key ingredient of positive change? It is people. People who have been taught to think, to solve problems for themselves and others, and people who can create new solutions that have never been thought of before. Virtual World School Myanmar invests in the intellectual capital of people in their formative years. Our vision is to raise a cadre of leaders from different ethnic regions of Myanmar and educate them in the ways of creative problem solving and team building. Since our model is to create positive change, we have created our pilot group from 20 children in their early years in an orphanage in Bago who would normally not have the chance to have dreams such as these. Without teachers and educational leaders, all the technology in the world will not produce progressive thought and independent thinking. Virtual World School began as the master's thesis of Zar Chi Min, a young teacher in Yangon who proposed the use of technology as a way to supplement the education gap in K-12 learning. Our Early Start program in Bago was launched as a collaboration between Zar and myself. Ms. Politino has been a leader in creating global connections for Myanmar through Young Arts International Foundation. Her grandfather was Edward Law Yon, the very influential editor-in-chief of the nation newspaper, who was famous for his articulate and progressive ideas. Ever since the United States lifted sanctions, Ms. Poller has fostered the principles of independent and creative thought in her many activities in the arts and education here in Myanmar and abroad. Now, she brings her education from Yale University and her experience as an educator in arts, charter school, public schools and international baccalaureate to virtual world school, Myanmar. Virtual World School fosters problem solving and empowers children to solve local problems through our CASA Culture and WeCow projects. Our CASA Culture presents experience through different caring and sharing areas, or CASA. They are me, people, place, things, and actions. WeCow stands for We Change Our World. The children learn from the examples of other children in the world to solve problems by our VWS step-by-step -step process. It was truly amazing how quickly the children took to applying their projects in their own lives and community. The last step of the recal process is sharing. We always come full circle at VWS by connecting back to the world and sharing our learning with the global community. Most of all, we at Virtual World School share a commitment to children and a vision that it is their generation that has the answers to their future, and possibly ours. As the global community enters Myanmar, it is clear that our country is wealthy with natural resources as well as the generous and caring nature of the local people. As global organizations set up here and tourism propagates throughout the country, we offer a heightened level of engagement through our programs at Virtual World School. With an Einstein sponsorship of 5,000 US dollars, your organization can fund the basic operations of a pilot laboratory such as our Early Start program for five years. We also offer coding and digital art and identity branding courses for children in their tween years. 
the future of a virtual world school is as boundless as the capacities of our children and fueled by the generous support of our sponsors. Thank you for sharing our vision and your invaluable support of the children of Myanmar and investing in our future together.